Hello everyone, you are in Endurance Laser Lab. Today I want to make you a live demo and show two interesting things. So first of all, I want to show you the, how um, the spot of the laser looks like. So this is the first thing I want to show. And the second thing I want to show how to work with Z-axis and uh, linear actuator, uh, actually a stepper motor, installed on a DIY engraving machine. So first of all, we install our laser on a DIY engraving machine. This is 10 watt endurance laser, and uh, we're going to show you the size and how the uh, laser spot looks like. We plan to aim the laser beam to this uh, golden uh, golden plate, and we're going to use an extra zoom. So as you can see, the laser spot is very very bright, even when we launch it at only 1% power. So if I zoom in, still there is a very big spot. So what I'm going to do next is uh, change ISO level on my camera and uh, change diaphragm on the camera. So let's uh, change ISO to 100. So now ISO is 100. Okay, and you see this spot is still bright and I'll change the diaphragm to a minimum so this is something like 36 136 so and there is very small spot now I'm going to use another camera to show you the entire process so uh, this is a 10x zoom on the mirror camera that I'm using um, Canon but you see the light is still bright, I mean the, the spot of the laser is still bright. So now I'm going to add green and red goggles as a filter so that you can see the, the spot. So you see that the spot became much smaller with a green filter. Let's check it out with a red goggles. Red goggles and you cannot see it. So red actually Red goggles are a little bit better of, in terms of protective. So, uh, in, in terms of protection. So, let me just uh, increase a little bit diaphragm. Okay, you can see red, red spot. We can still increase it a little bit. And like now, it's fully open for these. So, you see the red spot. Okay, so what I'm going to do next is change the height of the laser and make sure that uh, the spot will increase or decrease. Okay, now we're moving our Z-axis uh, laser down and this we see what happens to the spot. So it's increasing. So it means that we are getting away from the focal uh, range. Okay, let's go back and move backwards okay now we moving um, that axis up let's see what's happening with the spot spot is getting smaller so stop so I think that this spot is pretty much the minimum that we can get sorry for hands are trembling uh, with our laser. Let's check it out with the green goggles. Okay, now we are using green goggles and we move uh, that axis down. Let's see what we have. Now we're going to uh, move it up. So we're moving up our laser. And as you can see, um, the, the spot becomes smaller and smaller. So when it comes to, to round, something like that. So I think this is pretty much where we got the focus. So when if we go up, still go up, then you see the spot is becoming bigger. So that's how it looked like when you move up and down and actuator. So hope that you like this video. Sorry for trembling hands. It was quite complicated to to show you everything on a, uh, making movie on a smartphone and do it uh, with a camera. So when you do it yourself, just use a mirror camera 
when you try to get the best focus and uh, yeah now you can do really good focus with uh, with our lasers hope that you like this video please share it with your friends and have a wonderful engraving bye bye